اهلا وسهلا انا اسمي تمارا واليوم بدي احكي على الفيديو تاع تعب... تاع تاع ويت شو ام سبيكينغ ان عربيك ما بعرف I bet you didn't know that I am half Arab. Yes, I am from Bangladesh, but I am also Jordanian Palestinian. And today, for another episode of Oh the Horror, I will be reviewing a movie from Egypt that's available on Netflix. It's called Warda, which Warda means rose. Yeah, it means rose. I bet you're wondering. Tomorrow, I don't want to watch a movie about flowers. Like, I thought this was horror movies. It is. It's scary, okay? In the style of Paranormal Activity, this is a found footage type horror film. Please watch it in Arabic. Subtitles are for dummies. Wait, that was, I did that wrong. Dubbed is for dummies. <laughs> it just makes sense. Dubbed dummies. Why would you watch something dubbed? I mean, this is a whole nother video conversation that we will have. The movie follows a young man named Walid who goes back home to see his family in Egypt and is investigating some paranormal happenings in his family home. These occurrences have been going on since his father died, so it deals with grief and it also deals with family relations. He brings home a friend who is a woman. She actually is a woman. I don't know why I did the air quotes there. And his mom kind of kicks her out of the house because they, she finds them. Well, I won't give it away, but Warda is his little sister and she's been acting really strange. She doesn't eat. She is Possessed. The movie has a lot of jump scares and it's an interesting take on the found footage genre. Gorda is one of those movies that kind of leaves you at the edge of your seat. It is like the traditional, very scary, oh my god, what is happening type movies. I love that they filmed in one location, which was this beautiful home in Egypt. Yeah, definitely watch it because you get like an inside look at the way movies are made in these countries that are outside of the US. Because yeah, there's a world outside of our gates, people. Florida is great because it has amazing effects. Arabic people, I mean. It also has an ending that leaves you wondering, should I leave the light on for the rest of my life? At least the hallway light, because this is actually hurting my hand. <laughs> Florida is one of those movies that leaves you wondering who let the devil in the house? Who? Who is it? So I can call the police. No, actually the police won't help you. Who is it that let this demon in the house? I mean, somebody call the Ghostbusters or someone because why? Why are these demons and these devils in this house? Someone get them out. I mean, like clean it up, people. Just tell them to leave. Be like, bye. You don't like go. Go away. Thank you so much for watching another episode. Let me close off with a wonderful Arabic saying. Ya haywanat, bahabkum kulkum, bas Arabi mish kwayis. So, yalla bye.